Are you familiar with the new Seiko solution for safe, flexible and sustainable storage of different hazardous substances in a single cabinet? In everyday laboratory work, it is common to work with many different hazardous substances. For efficient operation, these are needed directly at the workplace. The amount of hazardous substances required in each case is constantly decreasing due to increasingly sophisticated processes. To accommodate the properties of the hazardous substances in use, various types of safety cabinets have been required, resulting in the purchase of different safety cabinets. For example, a fire-resistant cabinet for flammable liquids, a special acid alkali cabinet for corrosive substances, and a separately lockable storage cabinet for toxic substances. The result in practice, three cabinets that are often only partially filled. This is not just space consuming and inefficient, but also expensive. With the newly developed Type 90 tested multi-risk cabinet from Asecos, we can now offer the world's first hazardous materials cabinet for the unrestricted and safe storage of flammable liquids, acids and alkalis, as well as poisons, directly at the respective workplace. A completely new cabinet design and an integrated efficient ventilation system making this possible. For maximum ease of use and unrestricted access to all containers, the multi-risk cabinet has two vertical drawers that can be loaded and unloaded from both sides. Simultaneous opening of both pull-outs is also possible with the multi-risk cabinet. The metal frame is protected against corrosion by a special powder coating in conjunction with pre-galvanization. This allows the cabinet user the flexibility to decide which types of hazardous substances they want to store in the cabinet. With a cabinet depth of 86 centimeters, the multi-risk cabinet makes optimum use of the space available next to fume cupboards, and the width of 60 centimeters offers a high storage capacity. This saves space in the laboratory, whilst the cabinet also fits perfectly in the established laboratory furniture grid. Thanks to the specially designed draw runners, the manually operated vertical pullouts can be operated smoothly, even when fully loaded with up to 100 kilograms each. The integrated self-closing mechanism, which is soft-close, additionally supports the manual closing process. To meet the safety standard required in the event of fire, any open vertical pullouts are automatically closed by means of an integrated safety device. In addition, the storage levels can be adjusted individually by the customer to the required adjustment height within the cabinet. Of course, all storage levels are secured against tipping thanks to lateral upstands. With the optionally available lockable storage box, hazardous substances can be stored separately within the vertical drawer. In terms of ease of use, it is completely tailored to the multi-risk cabinet and can be opened via a slide-in mechanism. This allows convenient access to the containers from both sides. The ventilation concept of the multi-risk cabinet exceeds the requirements of EN 14470 Part 1. Instead of only extracting above the floor collection tray, the exhaust duct is mounted centrally on the rear wall, ensuring safe and uniform extraction at every storage level. In this way, the multi-risk enclosure offers optimum protection against hazardous vapours and explosive atmospheres. Various hazardous substances can thus be flexibly distributed in both vertical drawers and storage levels. The air exchange of the cabinet, which must be permanently operational, is monitored with an integrated safety assistance system. The monitoring system is factory configured to the minimum required exhaust air volume and signals excessively low exhaust air volumes via an LED display. The exhaust air system provided by the customer can therefore be optimally set for the required exhaust air volume. Furthermore, the system monitors that the vertical pullouts are closed after use. This is required as a closed cabinet ensures optimum technical ventilation of the interior and the best possible protection in case of fire. The optical signal warns of insufficient ventilation and open vertical pullouts. 
and the signal can be forwarded to a central control center by the integrated switch contact. This ensures the safe and energy efficient operation of the technical ventilation and save costs in the long term. In summary, we can therefore state that by purchasing one multi-risk cabinet instead of three individual cabinets for storing specific hazardous substances, not only can valuable laboratory space be optimized, but the energy costs for technical ventilation are also reduced. If hazardous substances are stored safely directly at the workplace, this will also save time and personnel costs.